Hey everybody, it's Joe doing back for another video. Today I'm at Volusia Top Gun because I heard a rumor that you could shoot this. I don't know what it's called because I'm not a gun person, but I heard that you can shoot three rounds and I was like, yes, I must do it. So I'm gonna go ahead and get that ready. I'm uh, waiting for Elaine to open up and I'm excited. All right, so I'm back at home now, and oh my gosh, I had so much fun shooting that gun. You have no idea. Uh, what was interesting was I was afraid that the kickback was actually going to be the worst part, uh, you know, and hurting my shoulder, And uh, but it didn't really. I mean, it was a kickback, but it didn't hurt. Uh, the weirdest part was when the round actually fired. <laughs> This is what I did when um, I was getting ready to fire the round. I would go. And as soon as I completely exhaled, um, I would then pull the trigger. And when that did, for some reason, my mouth automatically just went. Not in shock or anything. It just automatically opened. And I couldn't breathe for like a second. It was so weird, but really, really cool. I was like. This is the coolest thing in the world right now. So I was super excited about that. Um, I did want to show you the uh, the differences from when I hit the target. I hit not dead on bullseyes, but I still hit within the same circle of the inner circle of the target. Um, I grabbed this one for reference. This wasn't mine, but this is what a general target at a range would look like. Just strewn with bullet holes. Holy cow, this is a big target. Oh. So there we go. That's what a normal target looks like. And uh, yeah, set that off to the side. This one, however, was mine. Just three rounds. Booyah. See? Hello, I see you. <laughs> but yeah, those are, those are the three rounds that I shot. And uh, oh my gosh, I just, so much fun. So if you ever are in, where did I go again? Volusia Top Gun in Daytona Beach. If you ever go there, ask them about the shooting the 50 caliber rifle. And I guarantee you, you will have a blast. You only get three rounds and uh, you lay down on the ground as you saw. And I was, oh my gosh. And then when I did that, uh, as soon as the the rifle and the mat was brought out over to the center lane, <laughs> and uh, people were like, what is that? So they were like freaking out. And as soon as I got ready, there was um, where the video was being taken. Um, right behind that, there was actually a wall with a glass panel that people can watch from like a lobby area. And then behind that is the restaurant, which you can also see the range from there as well. Uh, but as soon as the, the rifle came out and uh, I saw so many people with cameras like, whoa, this is so cool. Look at this. Look at this gun and stuff like that. So I thought it was really, really, really cool that people got to see that. And as you heard, I don't know if you caught it, but when um, as soon as I fired that first round, you could hear it and I could hear it. People in the range started laughing because of how strong the shot was. It didn't sound like it in the video because as soon as that impact happened, the microphones dropped down a little bit to compensate for that. But, oh, it was a blast. And, oh, my gosh. So check it out if you're ever in Daytona Beach. I'm going to end this video here uh, because I have to edit this. And there is another uh, video that I'm going to be editing as well. And it's going to be completely different from what you're used to seeing in this channel. So check that out. And, yeah. 
Um, oh, by the way, happy St. Patrick's Day. Uh, that's why I'm wearing my holy. <laughs> it's an old shirt, but it's the only green shirt I had today. So, so hello to ta -da, my big uh, green shirt. <laughs> so anyways, happy St. Patrick's Day. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time.